Good evening guys, it's Kefka Retro here and it's time for part 7 of Final Fantasy X. And today I've decided that I'm not going to talk a bunch of nonsense and I'm just going to get on with it. Right, loading the game. Now, if you guys remember, last time I made a Kilika Temple. I didn't actually realise that I saved the game here, but apparently I did, so yeah. Anyway, yeah, we had just fought a bunch of plants and a bunch of, and, and a sin spawn um, outside the temple, and then we got to the temple, and now here we are, and now it's time to progress and see what happens next. First, I think I have to talk to people. Do I talk to people? Nope, he's not happy, shaking his head. Okay, whatever. Please, let Waka's prayers be heard. Oh, they're all praying. Okay. Lulu, hello? I think Waka needs to do a little more praying. Waka? Lord O'Holland, guide our feet. Shall I pray or shall I stand and watch? I mean, I'm not a praying man myself, but, um... For the sake of keeping everyone happy. Oh, is it gonna be bow? Is it gonna be bow? Ready, set, go. There's a bow. I've literally bowed every single time. Well, actually, no, not every time Waka just did. Oh, is that her name Donna? I think it's... A summoner, are you? I think it's Donna. My name is Yuna, from the Isle of Besaid. Donna? Yep, I was correct. So, you're High Summoner Braska's daughter. That's quite a name to live up to. My, my, my. And all these people are your guardians? <laughs> my, what a rabble. As I recall, Lord Braska had only two guardians. What do you mean? Quality over quantity, my dear. <laughs> Whatever were you thinking? I have need of only one guardian. Right, Bartello? What was that? I only have as many guardians as there are people I can trust. I trust them all with my life. To have so many guardians is a joy and an honor. Go on, you stick it to the man. Even more so or woman. than being my father's daughter. Of course, I would never think of questioning your ways either. So, Lady Donna, I ask of you, please leave us in peace. You do what you want, Bartella, we're leaving. Okay, bye. Wow, she ran off the screen. <sighs> A guardian is someone a summoner can rely on. Someone she can trust with her life. I wondered, did Yuna feel that way about me? Well, she did ask you to be her guardian, so surely... What's she smiling about? Not smiling? She was like... <laughs> the standard face, you know? Had a poker face on. But yeah, okay, do we go in now? Yes, we do. <clears throat> Oh, I just noticed my mouse has been on the screen that whole time. I just budged it off. The faith is below. Let's do it. The faith? But first, the cloister of trials. Kamari, Waka, ready? Why not ask me if I'm ready? Strength, everyone. Wow, Lulu is so selective. Kamari, Waka, you know, I'm there as well, you know. No. Ah. Hey, what gives? You're not a guardian yet. This is true. Um, true. We'll be back as soon as we can, okay? Obviously, Titus is gonna oh, somehow sure. break. Soon, like tomorrow soon, I bet. Obviously, Titus is gonna break some rules and gonna end up down there anyway. I think. Oh, I can't leave here. So let's just wait for the lift to come back up, and then we'll just hop on it anyway. Because you know he's a flipping rule breaker. Where the hell? Where the hell is this lift? Come on, lift. I can't leave, so it can't be out there. Well, I can't go out there. Oh, here we go. And down I go anyway. Where's Yuna? What are you back for? Then why are you here? Hey, I'm not a guardian, so I'm not supposed to go in, right? Oh, I remember what happens. Never mind. Hmm, not a guardian, you say? Hey, wait! What a butt. Ah! Did you really have to lift me up over his shoulder just to throw me onto the platform? Gow! Hey! What's a big idea? Just a little game. Huh? Also, what is she wearing? 
okay. Almost as bad as Kane from Nia. Really bad. Actually, no, Kane was worse. Right. So here I am, down in the cloister of the trials. Can I remember what I have to do? No, clearly not, because I've never played the game before. Go inside, wait here. Go inside, wait here. Go inside, obviously. Only guardians allowed. And I'm sure no guardian. Thank you, Mouse Titus. Well, I guess it's too late now. Right, so let's try and do this cloister of trials. I'm guessing, well, the only thing I can do here is the fire, is to get that spear. Take the spear? Yes. Or sphere. Remove the killer sphere. Where do I place it? In the door. Okay. You see a sphere shaped recess? Insert sphere. Um. Oh, I remember what I have to do. Yes, okay, okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. Yeah, the, like the doors have two stages in this. You put the sphere in to set the doors on fire and then take it back out again to move the fiery bit. Um, now there's a whole bunch of stuff going on here. Um, I don't know what goes with. Let's just place that sphere in there for the time being. See what happens. Nout, nothing. The glyph sphere. Okay, if I put it in there, what happens? Glyph appears. Okay, but that does nothing, okay? Oh, it's gonna be a bit of experimenting here to see what I have to do. I set the glyph sphere there, and the glyph appears. Right, let's take that Kilika sphere. I've got an idea. I think the Kilika sphere were in, in here. That's where I got the glyph from. Nothing happened. So they're making spheres of uh, glyphs appear on each and every side. Let me try putting the Kilika sphere. Oh! Lol, the pedestal can be moved. Well, that changes stuff around a bit. Okay, and that's also made a glyph appear. If I remove it, does that mean I can do something to that wall? Potentially. Can I go and touch that? Touch glyph, yep. Okay, so I can do that, so that's fair enough. That's nice and simple. Door opens, yep. Yep, yep. Mmm. A bit hot in here. Ah, there's a pedestal thing there as well. And here we have, hang on. Take the kill the sphere. Taken. It does nothing, okay? Um, I need to find a way to put the fire out somehow. <clears throat> yes, it's tell me. <clears throat> Excuse that, my, my voice, something's going on with it. Um, guess it's tell me to try and put um, the two killer spheres on either side in that room and see what happens. If I put the glyph sphere in there. Oh, it opens a door as well. Ah, secrets. Okay, so the glyph sphere opens the door and the fire vanishes. What's inside here? The, the destruction sphere. Right, I'm going to need that to obviously um, um, do some destructioning. Makes no sense, but okay. Um, I'm going to need that to try and uh, uh, open up the area for the secret... Um, blah, 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 blah. Open up the secret area for the treasure. I'm guessing it doesn't go there. But let's see what I have to do with the pedestal. So clearly I can push it into that room now. So... And I've got the fiery thing on it as well. Um, okay. I have to push it to that glowing, that, that dotty area? Oh, no, not backwards. Dotty area? The area glowing on the floor. Okay. Ah. 
that's open up another secret area. So okay, if I now take this take this sphere from here, a Kilikit sphere. Okay, I don't know what to do with that, but I got a feeling I have to put the destruction sphere down there, else there would be no point in opening up a secret area, right? Mm, makes sense. Okay, no. Okay, I got too many spheres over there. Let's just drop you in here. <coughs> Sorry, my voice is really messing up again. This happens, happen, no, no, this happens, this happens so frequently. Right, so now I've done that. If I go and get that destruction sphere, 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 it's a sphere. Sorry, I could sit here having a conversation with myself about what a bloody sphere is. Go down here, put the destruction -y guy in there. Does that give me the secret baby treasure? Damn right it has. Right on it. There we go. And if you guys remember, I have to do all of the destruction sphere things to get something very magical later on, which obviously you will all see. And I just noticed, I've got this weird, really weird flick in the back of my beanie here. I mean, none of you guys have really seen my hair, but that's actually my hair there somewhere. Somewhere. Right, so I've got that. Now, if I get this Kilka sphere, I bet you I can go and put that in the door opposite, and then I will be in the next area. Area. Why did I repeat myself? I repeat myself because it was high pitch. Insert that. Yep, now I need to remove that. That opens the door. What was that noise? Okay. In the next area I am. Oh, there we go. Hello, everybody. Whoa, whoa, whoa! It was Donna and that big muscle head man. That meanie. Yuna will be the one to suffer the consequences. Uh, what consequences? It'll be fine. She could be excommunicated. Mari's pissed as always. The chamber beyond is a sacred place. Only summoners may enter. What? Even guardians can't go? It's taboo. Oh. Everything is taboo to Waka. He says the word too much. Just wait. So okay. what's in there anyway? The faith, remember? Oh yeah, that thing, right. The Faith are people who gave their lives to battle sin. Yevon took their souls, willingly given from their still living bodies. That's quite harsh. Now, they live forever, trapped in statues. But when a summoner beckons, the souls of the Faith emerge once again. That's what we call an Aeon. All that in this room? Seems like a wonderful place to be. So, so what's Yuna doing in there? Praying? She prays with all her yeah. heart for a way to defeat sin. We're done with all the chit chat now. Can I go back to the door? <gasps> nope. Okay, he's still pissed. Jeez, man, I want to kick him. She's not talking anymore. Just wait. Wait, he's not talking anymore? There we go, okay. Hello, Yuna. She always looks like she's about to pass out or something. She's drunk when she comes out from there. But she's having a flipping party with the faith. There was something I didn't tell anyone else that day. That song we heard there in the temple, I knew it from my childhood. It was proof that Spira and Xanarkin were connected somehow. At least to me it was. Maybe that's why suddenly I felt like I just wanted to go home. I tried to say something to tell them, but the words wouldn't come. Wow, that was a very long fade out. Oh, Ifrit, confirmed. This is our next day on. I'm guessing we're done with the temple. Let's see. Where oh, I didn't mean to walk into there. Please. Where to go to next? Back down to uh Kilika? Hmm. 
Yes, people are excited once again. And the dress sense of the public is very different compared to Yuna and her crew. I'm having an another dream again. Or a memory. I thought I had put my feelings for Xanarkin behind me. What are you doing there? He was like doing this weird dance. But they were there, and they grew inside me bigger and bigger, till I was just about ready to burst. You don't want to do that, it'll be a bit messy. Are, are you okay? I... I don't know. What do you want to do? To scream real loud? <laughs> <laughs> so he just goes ahead and does it. Also, I noticed something there which was a bit annoying. Yuna spoke to Titus there like he was a child. She goes, What do you want to do? As if, like, geez, as if like, she had to like speak really slowly just so you'd like recognize the words. I mean, I'm only from a thousand years in the past. I don't mean language change. Actually, then, then again, language probably would have changed very much, so. Well, then, yeah, it did, I suppose. But was the Albed language, which he didn't know about in his days. In his days? In his... Yeah, in his days, in his time, yeah. Was there any reason to do my overdrive then? Probably not. Overkill. Boom. Um... Let's attack you, know, auto-attack, 20 damage, boom, OP. Come on, Lulu, take, take care of it. There we go, okay. Hopefully no more battles now until I get back to town. I can't remember which way back to town was. Yeah, I can. Yeah, I can. Here and then down. And down some more! Okay, no more attack, yep. Killed, yep. Skip, skip, use uh, unit attack. Water, dead. really easy, I'm just one-shotting these guys. Why are you leaning down for? He just wants to show off that cleavage. Right, so we should be back in Kilika now. We need that a lot. Yes, we are. Now I think I need to go to the boat. I think everything we need to do here is done. Embark? Not yet. Let's embark. Off to Luca at last. The matches start as soon as we get there. So rest up on the way, yeah? Oh god, I sense Blitzball coming really soon, and Blitzball was a game I absolutely hated playing. That's gonna be fun. It's actually quite technical-ish, and someone's gonna say, you know, it's really easy. So we're done Kilika, and now we're going to be on our way to Luca. And after all these scenes, I shall be ending the video. But she's going to have another deep conversation with him. Well, they're saying something we couldn't hear. I think it's demonstrating what they're all up to, but not really going into detail. Look, look at him, he's all depressed just sitting in the corner down there and everyone else is having a chat upstairs. Or on deck. And these guys are all chatting too, and Tyler's just chilling out. Right, so yeah, I think I'm going to end the video there. Hopefully when I walk through this door, the game saves. It does. Ooh, and it's also a cutscene. Clothes you're wearing. Yeah, filthy, filthy. This won't sell. All me names, not a waka. This guy's weird. Don't look like you got much money either. 
I've no business with you. Out of me way. Who do you think you are? Awaka the 23rd. Merchant extraordinaire. Awaka the who? Don't know me? Well, not many do. Not yet. Even though you're the 23rd. Right, so yeah, I'll save the game there. Um, that's part 7 of Final Fantasy X. Um, it was a shorter part to what I would normally play, purely because I, kn I knew what the next step was, and I just wanted to get the whole... Oh, the boat's changed as well. The last boat was called the SS Licky. Now it's called the SS Winnow. Anyway, yeah. Um, yeah, I just wanted to ensure that we got Ifrit and stuff, and I did a cluster of trials, and embarked on the way to Luca. So, yeah. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And I'm tapping on my controller as I said that, so it might be really annoying. But yeah, take care now. Goodbye.